Hey guys, I'm Chantel. I'm a NASM certified personal trainer and a fitness nutrition specialist. And today I want to put you guys on on some fitness nutrition related stuff. How to read the back of your protein shakes, your protein bars, and those things that they advertise, great source of protein, high in fibers, all those little things. Because sometimes those things are causing more harm than good. If you like this video, be sure to like this video, help me grow my channel, and let's get into it. How to read the back of the label of these so-called healthy stuff. Look how pretty it is. I am gonna miss but the number one thing you should check for when you're buying these protein bars and supplements is the sugar content the grams of sugar in a particular product should not exceed the grams of protein in that product for a while i was buying a specific brand of yogurt thinking oh my gosh yes this was before i got educated in this whole fitness nutrition thing i was buying a specific brand of yogurt and i was like yes oh my gosh this yogurt is healthy because it's yogurt and it's white only to find out that that specific yogurt had twice as much it was like 20 grams of of sugar to 10 grams of protein no way in no way that is healthy it needs to be called a sugar bar or something like that it makes no sense why they advertise it like that and why they're even allowed to advertise it like that knowing the effects that too much sugar have on the human body sugar not only aid in weight gain but these diseases that's popping up out of nowhere like let's say cancer for example cancer is just like every one in six death is from cancer these days and where was that back in the days right ask yourself that question anyways so i went to walmart earlier today and i recorded some clips of how to check the back of these protein bars and shakes and stuff like that and i'll insert the clip right here just to make sure that the the difference in grams of sugar and grams of protein is lower sugar needs to be lower than your protein not significantly lower of course the lower the better and then yeah you know some products with less sugar doesn't taste as great as the high um, sugar content but we're here for lifestyle changes we're here to not only look good but to be good be healthy on the inside and these small changes like checking the back of the label to make sure that you're not taking in too much sugar is what will help you get to your weight loss goals to help live a, live a healthier lifestyle and just be the best version of you the best version that you can be i hope this video is helpful big big takeaway from this video is to check the sugar to protein content the sugar should not be higher than the protein i mean it might differ by like two one or two grams but anything higher and anything significantly higher is a big no no like this video if you like this video i hope it was helpful for somebody i hope you learned something today i'm going to be transferring all my fitness related videos and my nutrition and fitness stuff over to my authentic channel so follow me there if you're interested in more fitness stuff and nutrition workout routine whatever and if you're if you're here for the fitness follow me over there if you're here for the lifestyle <laughs> subscribe here my contact information is below if you have any question about anything at all again again thank you for watching this video and i'll see you guys in the next video bye